A concert in Bemidji is spreading a message through music that differences should be celebrated, not criticized. For this week's In Focus, Jamil Donath shows us how the St. Paul One Voice Mixed Chorus and Community Singers came together tonight to sing for social change. One voice, many people singing together for diversity. We're just like everybody else out there, you know. Some of us are city folks, some of us are country folks, some of us are country folks trying to be city folks. <laughs> the St. Paul One Voice Mixed Chorus's more than 100 LBGTA members joined forces with Bemidji Community Singers Friday night to put on a show for social change. Music has a way of healing and bringing people together and we love all those aspects too. Bring a message of inclusivity and, and love. The One Voice concert is part of an outreach tour where the chorus performs in rural communities across Minnesota. It's a very important thing to come into these communities, especially in outstate Minnesota, where GLPTQ folks are often feeling isolated. I think this is highly needed to try to get ourselves out there, let people to see what we do, get a little bit more acceptance. While the chorus has a serious message, they're all about poking fun at themselves and having a good time. This particular concert is all things Minnesota. That includes things like the state fair. So what better than having their songs on a stick? It's really about Minnesota. Um, it's about Minnesotans, Minnesotans who are composers or songs about Minnesota because that's who we are. I mean, we're all Minnesotans. There are songs about spam and songs about ham. Our goal with any performance is to surprise you, to make you laugh, and to make you cry. But while entertaining, mainly the music is about togetherness. That's truly one of the most important things about this is being with people in the community, standing with. If they can hear our story and know that we're just the neighbors next door, the people next door, the couple next door, the family next door. Whether gay or straight. Wonderful, wonderful folks who have uh, every, every reason to have every right that I enjoy. And, um, and so I do it for them. I see the pavement being laid. I think we're, we're making some strides and I'm happy with it. These vocalists are reaching hearts by raising their voices. Through song. For this week's In Focus, Jamil Donath, Lakeland News. And one voice will return to northern Minnesota in February for another community concert. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.